cap for it because that, that is looking out there but the rest of it looks really solid i'm thinking one of the cylinders still isn't firing right i won't know until i put my tool on to check the alarm codes but right now clear some stuff out of the way in the shop fill up the tire move the car in so we pull the tire off get that fixed tomorrow and start putting the pieces back on the car Just getting things in place, not putting anything in hard yet. So you gotta line everything up and all that good stuff. Nothing else. This car is going to have a very distinct look by the time we're done with it.
it's on the next piece. To go back and review tape on that one. Yeah. Joke with my gloves on there. After painting it, you get a little sensitive to any dust that's on there. But it's cured at this point. It's been a week. Actually, more than a week. And since this is just going directly onto the plastic bumper, you don't want to crank it. Just get her snug. And all I can find is the broken reflector, I can't find the good reflector. Bummer. Yeah, those are pretty easy to get to. I should. And I should really replace this one anyway, so it probably come as a set. Oh. Oh. Yeah. 
Not necessarily a good one. Good on you. easier if I just get a socket or a well, my nifty socket opening. These guys. Of course, got the right size now. Oh, it's a 13 millimeter. Derf. You know, I think maybe there's a nut and bolt that goes in these ones here. I'm not seeing anything. Actually, grab a thread. Cool. All the other. Got to get Taylor over here to help me lift the hood on. And crank, crank down these corner posts before I'm done tonight. Damn, I'm getting close to calling it for the night.
And you know, this guy doesn't actually go here. Rather, this guy, which is the post for the arm to hold, to hold the hood up. Found some parts that might matter. Bummer. There's nothing too heavy. So. So unfortunately, the camera died last time, I didn't realize it. Um, so you can see me single-handedly lift the bumper under the car. And it looks like I've got limited space left on my camera as it is, didn't realize it. So um, the, the uh, running lights, or the, um, I forget what they're called. Anyway, the light housing area broke on, on one side. I can't find the other one, so I've ordered a new set and they should be here probably tomorrow. Um, so what I've got left is to mount, is to pin the screws to mount the bumper to the fenders. I'm gonna get Taylor in here tomorrow to help me mount up the hood. I um, don't have time for that tonight and I'm not gonna try that one single-handedly. Um, and then that's really left what's left here for the motor. I've got a new radiator cap that I'll pick up tomorrow, and that's a big deal there. So it's still running a little rough, but I can't tell if it's because I've got a miswiring or because the gas is just old. Because I've taken several months to do this, and you know, I could drop the tank or not the same gas is left, and maybe just drive it out. Um, then after that, Taylor's asked me to put in a new stereo with the subwoofer. The small subwoofer is a self-contained amp that I've had around for a while. It's gone through the other kids. Uh, so I'll be filming, putting that in as well here. But I'm trying to wrap this whole thing up because today is Tuesday. He gets his license on Friday and wants to be able to drive this up to work on Saturday. So that is where we are at.